Hi, it's me, Roger, doing an update. Um, hadn't been doing any while. We've been through this whole coronavirus, Kung flu, Wu flu, quarantine, or um, stay at home or whatever and stuff like that here in the Metroplex. But uh, anyway, um, one of the projects I've been working on, I've been struggling with the last couple years was um, when I switched boats about eight years ago and went to a hand controlled trolling motor instead of a um, foot controlled trolling motor. One of the things that I noticed was the foot switches or the stump switches was constantly getting stuck, uh, staying on even after you un let your foot off the switch and stuff like that. So um, one of the things I noticed was as, as a hive, a poundage, or a thrust trolling motor I have, um, I've got a 80-pound thrust trolling motor. That's a lot of current to be putting through these um, TH Marine stomp switches right here. So. Uh, one of the things that I looked up doing was to put an actual relay in place, a heavy-duty relay. That way you actually have a 12-volt circuit controlling the foot switch for the control circuit. Then the actual relay part actually uh, with contract contacts that are rated for that high of a current actually controlling the current that goes to the trolling motor. So anyway, uh, that's what I did. I ordered a heavy-duty um, relay 120 amp relay off of Amazon got it here uh, took the boat apart this morning and what I did was I took some power off of a 12 volt adapter I had up here in the bow I don't use it um, I have an adapter up by my console I keep my phone at and stuff like that so anyway I took 12 volts off here ran it through my switch through my foot switch right here back to to make the control circuit for my relay uh, then took the actual 24 volts um, of the trolling motor and ran it through the contacts right here. So anyway, um, I'm gonna see if maybe you can hear this. I've got the foot switch working. You can kind of hear it. So anyway, and as soon as I let off the switch, the motor stops. Whereas before, if I was at a, um, a high speed, I'd be going along, trucking along to the next spot, stuff like that. I would let off and the trolling motor would still keep going. So anyway, putting this relay in here um, seems to have kind of helped that situation. I'm going to bundle this up in some plastic to make sure it doesn't get wet or anything to kind of short anything out and shove it back up here underneath the bow. But anyway, um, I'm going to go fishing tomorrow. I really want to give this a try. But um, everything I'm reading, that's what people were doing um, for the particular foot switches right here. Anyway, hope this helps. If anybody's got any questions, they can shoot me a message on YouTube. I'll try to answer as much as I can, but um, you can also Google search these things and a lot of people have used this uh, mechanism. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. God bless y'all. Stay safe. Don't get the Kung Flu.